Hello everybody and welcome back to Let's Play Stardew Valley. In the last episode, we got our farm really going, we planted a ton of crops, and we also got the barn, and that's in the process of being built right now. Spirits are displeased. Okay, that's fine. I didn't really plan on going to anywhere where that would matter at all anyway. Well, you know what? There was something that I planned to do that has a little bit of luck to it. And that's, I want to just cut down a ton of trees. We do have an upgraded axe now, so we can do it a lot more effectively. Also, hello, uh, corn, I could just take that. I need to make sure that I have five gold star corns, so I'll keep those. And the other one can just be sold. In fact, you know what? It can just go into a preserves jar. They don't sell for a ton individually, so there's no point in really... It, they're going to benefit a lot from the 30 increase that the preserves jar gives. More hops, of course, because we get that every day. Make sure I do not pluck my sunflower. Cool. And we got some more maple syrup, so if we wanted, we could make another bee beehive. Uh, what did it take again? Maybe we can't. I think it took something that we ran out of as well. Iron bar and coal. That's right, it took coal. Yeah, I'm gonna cut down a ton of trees today just because I want to do it. That's a funny time for that to stop. It's melon jelly. That's right, that'll be worth quite a bit. Sweet. Just, uh... Well, I need the money today. Probably not. We did just get the iridium fishing rod as well. Still at two sturgeon. I could go fishing for some more sturgeon to fill up the the fish pond before, you know, I have to wait four days each to get each sturgeon. I'll go ahead and fill this up too while we're here. It goes down slowly. I think they just kind of tend to eat it whenever the hay or the grass is a bit too far away. But yeah, I'd like to start cleaning up a good portion of all of this. That's our fruit tree, so I'll try to remember not to chop that down. Uh, anyway, one of the reasons I want to go ahead and start cutting down a ton of trees is because I would like to get up to level 9, 9 foraging, before halfway into fall. And the reason for that is for a similar reason to why we needed to reach level 4 foraging for the middle of spring. Because those blackberries, if you can get three blackberries each, that will be a little bit nutty. I'll... Yeah, I'll plant these, I guess. I suppose right there and there, just out of the way a bit. I don't think that one's going to hatch. Hatch, I hate myself. That's not going to come up there with the barn either. Those ought to be up like halfway into fall. Cool. I think I've dealt with everything in terms of the farm. So I'm going to clean out my inventory and I'm going to get to work. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Before I get too involved with all that, I have to remember today is Demetrius's birthday. Uh, 1,800. Cool. Well, unfortunately, I didn't save any strawbies. So instead, what we'll do for that, and I guess we'll, I'll do a little bit of fishing while we're out here just so we can get a sturgeon or two. I think the thing that I want is going to be open. This is not where I wanted to go. Town. Please? It's Friday. It should be open, right? Yeesh, do you like my bow? Oh, I, I was thinking bow and arrow. Don't ask why. Demetrius loves ice cream. And if I could give that man ice cream, Haley's headed down. I don't think it's open on Friday, is it? Ooh, that's unfortunate. That's a bit of timing there. Well, what I can do instead, hello Sam. What I can do instead for this Friday is I need to go check out the traveling cart because I want to see if we got that specifically red cabbage seed. In fact, I think it can go for 2,000 so I might not even have enough money for it. Hello, worm. Another lost book, nice. If I remember off the top of my head, you actually do get something for getting all the lost books. That is a spice berry right in front of your cart. Cockle, coconut. Coconut would be a fun one to get this early. Hardwood, duck feather, and another rare seed. Man, they really do be selling those rare seeds. I could just get them 
it could yield quite a bit of money. Uh, can I cut these down? No, you can't cut those ones down. Well, while I'm here, might as well take another trip to the secret forest because there is something that we need from it. And luckily it's growing. Cool. Fiddlehead ferns. They grow here in the summer. And they're actually one of the items you need for a bundle, so... It's good to keep an eye out for those. And I think the last time we came in here, we weren't able to find them because it was Sunday. And that's the day that everything, like, resets. So we weren't able to grab them. But yeah, I'm just going to cut down all these, grab all the fiddlehead ferns I see. I believe if you were to upgrade your axe in spring, you'd be able to find... Ugh, certain mushrooms that normally would be pretty hard to find like the red and purple mushrooms I think you can find in here in addition to the chanterelle which is the one that has all the holes in it I doubt I said that right but hey you know what I mean the the holy mushroom and then fall I mean you'll see what happens here in fall because I'll I'll be there Anyway, it was worth cutting all those down just for the experience. Uh, yeah, I'm just gonna start cutting down these trees, try to get that foraging experience up, and I'll see you in a little bit. Actually, no, I can't do that because I need to do Demetrius' birthday. I don't want to miss it. He's kind of a hard man to please. The only thing he really loves is strawberries. I think what I'm gonna have to do is settle for giving him one of his liked gifts. I really thought that the ice cream thing would be open, especially on a Friday. I, I guess I should have considered that maybe it's not open on Friday, but I thought it would especially be open on Friday because it's Friday and it's ice cream and it's summer. It makes too much sense. They're losing out on so much business. Also, I realized I need to make another scarecrow for... What is it? A piece of coal, I think, for a scarecrow? Yeah. I need to make another scarecrow for that area over there. Let's see. Hopefully you're not eating my crops. I'll bring him... a... tomato. Everyone loves tomatoes. I do need that tomato for the community center. Hold on, I'm gonna get another tomato, right? I didn't destroy it somehow. I think it's that one on the bottom right, but I'm not willing to risk it. I could give him hot pepper, which should work just fine as well. Oh, hey, funny, I would find you walking around here. Cool, it is a liked item. Oh, I took all the peppers, huh? That I can go ahead and give one to Lewis. Wait, what? Pretty exciting, huh? I didn't read that. That was something that I've never read. I don't talk to Demetrius a ton, so... It's all new. One thing I wanted to mention about the... The friendship decay with everyone is like, even though it's a two... I've already given him two gifts? What did I give him? Even though it's only two friendship for not talking to someone in a day, you gotta consider it's every single person losing two. So there's what... There's quite a few villagers. Like that looks to be about 25. So overall in a day you'd be losing 50 friendship. So anything you can do to out friendship the loss, you should do it. Anyway, I'm not sure how bad I wanna go on all of these trees down here other than the, uh, cause I, the forest trees always come back. I know this to be true. Also, we have a really high chance of scarecrows coming because we just have so many crops because the chance for crows increases at like 40 crops planted, which we definitely have, so gotta watch out for that. But yeah, I, I don't know how many of these trees I really wanna chop down because they don't grow back indefinitely. I'd have to get seeds from elsewhere, but I think we'll be fine. All right, I'm going pretty late into the day here and you're going to see why. So I checked my level and I actually am leveling up and foraging today. And normally when you're up really late, you would you would wake up and you would have like, I think it's 75 to 60% of your energy for the day to start out. But if you level up, you automatically start with full energy no matter what. So I took that opportunity to
to really just go absolute ham on these trees. And I'm going to stay up all the way until like 1.30. Because it's after 1 that you start like really losing your energy. And then of course if you're up until like 2, I believe you take a money hit as well. So I'm just going to go crazy, go stupid. I'm also going to clear out all this fiber because I do not need that. And the more mixed seeds we could find anyway would be nice because I'd like to be able to start fall off with just tons of mixed seeds. Go ahead and break this. I didn't know I still had a giant rock on my farm. Oh, I am... Okay, I don't need the green algae. But yeah, I think this is the first time that I've actually like purposefully tried to do this trick. Staying up really late and taking advantage of all this, so... Just as a heads up. I shouldn't clear that out up there. I should clear this out down here. But yeah, now I know that I basically have free time to just do whatever I want all the way up until 2 a.m. Because 2 a.m. is when you pass out. I haven't stayed up that late, and I don't want to. Oh, I'm already full on hay. There's no reason to cut this. Yet I will anyway, because it's annoying. Uh, Let's see. I have a few more minutes. I'm going to just get a little bit of energy so I can like clear out all the annoying stuff here. I'm not cutting down the trees that are like growing just so I have a guarantee that I'll have, I say as I cut down shrubs, just so I have guarantee that I'll have trees growing throughout all this time because that's something to be aware of I suppose. How much wood does that give us? We have started our second stack of wood. Uh, we have fiddlehead ferns. They don't really have too many uses. I think they're used in a few recipes. Hey, let me grab these. No, I didn't click the map. Craft them summer seeds. Put that away. Just trying to organize a little bit. We didn't do a ton today, so I, you know, just filling up the time. I really need to go now though. Who boy. Yeah, let's just go. I can organize everything else tomorrow. Pet our cat. Let's go. Look at that. And we got tree fertilizer. Now, this can be useful because you can instantly grow a tree. We got the wild seeds for winter, which is the only one that's worth planting. Then we got a warp totem for the mountains, but I don't know how easy that'll be to make. Other for the seeds. That's right. I always forget. Only a 15,000. 1,500. 15,000 would be nuts this late in. This early in, rather. Day 20. As I remember, there's not really anything going on today. Beautiful sun. Jeez. We got good humor. Okay. I could... Hmm. It might actually be... Oh, my barn's ready. Well, we gotta go buy a barn animal. Gathering data on correlation between soil ac alkalinity... And crop fructose levels. Long story short, I need a fresh melon from your farm. If you probably want to be grateful. Cool. Funny enough, we have one. Uh, ugh. There's that tomato I was worried about. Look at that. Look at that. Eh. I wish I could see. Have I put away a tomato before? 60. Okay. Just trying to, like, gauge what should be put into... Be, what should be jammed? Jelly. Gooey. 160. Wait, where do they get 160 from? Maybe it's just if you don't make it with any specific fruit. Anyway. Yeah, I think tomato would be the thing that's most worth putting into the... To the keg. Ooh. Sure. Why not? And a spice berry, because who cares? Well, I'll get to watering my plants, and we'll take care of the melon thing a little bit later. Did we ever do that pale ale thing? We didn't. Interesting. And our starfruit's still going. It's crazy. Then we have the melon now. Okay. I mean, I could just buy a pale ale, to be fair. I think we would make more money than we would lose from buying one for that, but... I'll, I'll hold on, just to make sure. 
if I don't have enough. Well, I'll definitely have enough time to make it. It's just for whenever that starfruit finishes. Anyway, this is what the barn looks like. It has the same kind of thing as a coop. It's a little bit bigger. And you can actually, like, build things in here. You could put kegs or whatever you want. Just as a heads up. I don't think I actually have the money for a barn animal today, actually. So we might be able to finesse something by selling stuff. Hard to say. Let's check out those crafting recipes as well. So we got tree fertilizer with, with just fiber and stone, huh? You could do that for mahogany trees. Interesting. It doesn't work with, yeah, it literally says doesn't work with fruit trees. So don't bother. We got the mountain totem, hardwood, iron bar, stone. I mean, I guess it's not that crazy. There's not many reasons I'd want to warp to the mountains though. What else was it that we got? I completely forgot. It could have been like a fertilizer or something. I don't even remember. Worm bin. I'd like to make one of these, actually. So, bait is its own bait. There's two different kinds of bait. We use the basic bait made of bug meat. Worms, if you use them as bait, you have a chance of getting two of the fish. I think it's a 50% chance to get two fish of whatever you pull out. So, I'm actually going to make that right now. And we have a ton of hardwood that we don't need. So, why not? can make hardwood fences now that we have all this hardwood as well. Uh, what was that again? Gold bar, iron bar. I, I have that, right? Yeah, sure. We'll make two. Because I do like my fishing. And these can actually go, like, back here. And those will always be making a worm. I don't know how often it produces. I want to say, like, once a day. It's so like every morning or so we should get one of those out of there. I'm not 100% sure about that, so don't destroy me. Also, one thing that I haven't been doing that you can do, if we go into options, there is a screenshot button. I've never done this. So you can take a screenshot. I don't know if there's an easy way to look at that from here, but what I would be able to do is look at the farm through it. Oh man, where does it save it? I have no idea where it saves the file. What you can do with that is you can take a screenshot of your farm, especially if you have a beach farm, and use that to find any forageables that have washed up on the beach or any of those supply crates. It's a really good way to go about it, so I'd recommend doing it if you uh, don't care about passing a little bit of time doing that. Uh, let's see. I really want to find out so first of all, it only says most days, right? Yeah, I don't know if Marnie's Ranch is open. I want to find out if I'll be able to make enough money to get a cow. Because I want to say they're pretty dang expensive. Them boys ain't cheap. So I'm really going to have to squeeze out some money if I want to do that. I mean, I have plenty. I could sell the Iridium Bar, which wouldn't sell for a small amount, that's for sure. If I really wanted to. I need to, like, put away some of this stuff. We have all these coffees. Let me just manage my inventory real quick. Okay, I think, I'm thinking if we just go walking around town, we might be able to find uses for all of our stuff. Emerald. I'm trying to remember who loves emeralds. I want to say it's, like, Haley? I'm not really 100% sure. Hold on, I should look at all my other stuff to see what we can sell. You know what? Let's also take a trip to the... To the bundles, just to get rid of all the stuff that we've been gathering for, like, a while now. Maple syrup. Plum. Apple. No reason to really do the corn or anything yet. Oh, I do have cloth. Do I need that for... No, I don't need that for anything. I'm gonna see if I can, like, sell my old weapons and stuff. Because I recall being able to do that at the Adventures Guild, and that would free up a lot of room here. In addition to the small magnet ring, because I'm not gonna need that at all anytime soon. I could sell these bat wings as well. I'm not going to need 60 of them. Cool, that's the plan. Let's head off. 
All right, first of all, so I don't mess anything up, I'm going to put everything into the bundles before I start selling stuff that I need. Specialty fish, we got the wood skip. We could get the ghost fish uh, sometime soon because that's been waiting for us for a while. I know the fiddlehead is one of these. Yep, right there. And the maple syrup as well, actually. That leaves truffle, fried egg, and maki roll, which are... All fairly simple to grab. Fodder bundle we, bundle we can go ahead and put... Oh, we need three apples to do that? Okay. I believe the rest that we need are... I couldn't move. I was in like an extra dialogue box there or something. The rest should be over here. Summer crops, we got tomato. Tomato. That's not a tomato, that's a... Jeez. We still haven't done a blueberry, huh? Weird. I should remember to do that next time we get a pull from it, which should be tomorrow, actually, so that's fine. And that's it, I want to say. Did I have anything else here? No. Cool. I think it might just be wiggling because it's, like, summer, the season, so it wants you to be sure, like, hey, don't mess it up. Oh, I could have put maple syrup here as well, as well as oak resin. I definitely had that. Whoops. Fall foraging, we have the blackberries. That's it for the- oh wait, hold on. Pomegranate for black f or What is that, a wild plum? That's all I brought, right? Yeah, because we can't use the apple yet, I suppose. That's fine. I didn't- I didn't know you actually had to have them all be- three, like, all at the same time? Because I know you can put different quality levels in at the same time, so. I don't know, I just figured. One quartz at three times the market value. That's only 75, but I suppose it would be worth it for the friendship gain. Apparently it's a lot. I thought it was, like, not a lot of friendship gain. It's, like, 150. So that's not a tiny amount. That would bring us up above 4,000, which is what I think we need. And we're going to be getting plenty of apples now that I planted that apple tree, so I'm happy with just selling that. Uh, brought an amethyst for you. Heck yeah, buddy. Starting to freeze. Dude, it's the 20th of summer. Come on now. Get with it. So next up would be... I do want to sell my stuff at the Ventures Guild, but I can just take the minecart to do that whenever. I'm going to check out Marnie's now. Mountains look nice. They sure do. I hope he brings you some toy. Yeah, don't bet on it. Don't bet on it. Oh, hello. Come in, Rob. I want to show you something. It's my secret hobby. I've been practicing for months. Now sit back, relax, and allow yourself to be carried away to a better place, okay? Oh, boy. Yep. You know, sometimes you have a scene where you... You discuss someone's dad maybe not coming back from war. Sometimes you have a scene where you're trying to talk a drunken person out of not killing themselves. And then you get this. Have I been drugged? I want to say that this might have just been Concern Zape, just excuse to do, hey, what weird things could I do? Also, I find it funny how it, since I have the screen enlarged a little bit, I'm pretty sure this is supposed to fill the whole screen, but it's like cut off at where you would normally be zoomed in. Out of breath out of, out of, after that, that one. What did you think? Say nothing and do a slip. No, I could. I couldn't. Thank you. Ugh, that was quite a workout. I haven't been this sweaty since I ordered the pepper platter at Abigail's graduation fiesta. Well, I'd better take a shower. Thanks for watching. And see you all tomorrow. But before you take that shower, I've got an emerald for you.
Oh, I thought she wasn't even home. That was gonna be weird. Don't tell anyone about, one about the dance. That was for your eyes only. Oh God. Can I look at this? It's a bolt of blue cloth. There's pieces cut out, cut out of it and a little embroidered pattern along the fringe. Cool, dude. Oh yeah, if you're wondering, the sewing machine's right here. So if you bring cloth and pretty much any other item in the game, you'll be able to combine them into making a unique, unique clothing item. And I'm going to look, I have something in mind. I've been saving that rainbow shell. And mind you, I have not like checked to see what gives you what. I feel like the rainbow shell would give you something pretty good, wouldn't it? Hello, another scene for you. Oh, hi, Rob, come on in. This is the first time we've come into our house. I'm just working on the sculpture here. Come here, watch this. See that? I'm revealing the essence of the wood. Once you get past the outer layers, the true nature starts to show. I like how it says, creepy. May I have a kiss? Just in case you didn't know that it was creepy. They just wanted to make sure you were aware. It's the same with people. What? Oh, yeah, that's absolutely right. I feel like she just went on along with what we said. I first visited the valley as a little girl while on vacation with my parents. I knew I had to come back someday. This place has great artistic potential. Although, I have to admit, it's not easy to pay the bills as an artist. Maybe if you paid the bills as a farmer. Uh, have an art show. That'd be fun. Hmm, interesting. I guess I could set the wheels in motion to making Pelican Town a true art destination. But what if no one likes my sculptures? I'd be crushed. I'll have to think about it. Well, thanks for stopping by. You got it, and now I'm gone. Well, actually, I came to bring you driftwood because it's gotta have some use in our show for the whole village. That's not a bad idea. That, oh, I thought that said that's a bad idea. That's a bold idea, Jeesh. Yeah, once you get two hearts with her, that's when you really get things rolling because you finally, you're finally able to just go into her house to talk to her. All right, 1220, please be open. Oh, yes. How much is that? 1500, I could have swore it was like 4,000. Well, I guess I'll go ahead and get two cows then. Oh, what's my list of names here? Now, here's the thing. I don't want to just like, <laughs> it, it so sounds a little weird to name people after, you know, a cow, because that's how it be. Uh, let's see. Let's name this one Randy. Once again, after certain people in the Discord. And I'm going to get another one, too. Because two cows is beneficial. Trona, Niku, Roke, Kella, Friskers. Uh, no. How about this one be... I don't know if I'm going to end up selling this cow. Probably not. Cows sell for a lot. Rat Prince. Bada boom, bada bing. Guess where that one came from? Well, there you go. Now we have two cows. So that'll be a little bit of work. Uh, I think I actually need to buy a pail. I do. That's a thousand good lord. Yeah, if you want to milk your cows, you're going to have to buy a pail. Because you gotta milk them into something. But that's all. It's like how you'll need shears if you have sheep, if you want to collect the wool. Then you gotta turn the wool into cloth. It's a, it's a whole thing. Well, I haven't really decided what to you went on an adventure, didn't you, little buddy? Um... I didn't really decide what to do other than that. I could go actually into the mines to try and get a little bit more charcoal. I could try to get a little deeper. Eh, I don't really... Oh, God. Oh, God, that's going to be money. Starfruit wine, drink in moderation. And I believe that's also a 
Yeah, it can go in the, what was it? Like artisanal something or other. Exotic foraging, no. Was it animal? No. You can see we actually have milk here, so. that'll. I haven't turned in a large white egg yet. Oof, whoops. I know it was somewhere. Huh. Maybe it was for the bulletin board. What do you think it would be? Oh, it's the enchanter's bundle. Yeah, when it's not a wine that literally gives us thousands of coins, I think I'll put it in. But no, that's getting sold right away. No hesitation on that. Gonna let my cows out. I'm gonna have to plant some grass around here as well. If I want them to properly get out. You can't milk them yet. Don't milk your baby cows, please. That's a very bad idea. I'll have to give them a little loving before they do that. Yeah, I think I'll just head on to the mines. That seems like a... That seems to make sense. I still need to sell, like, all my extra stuff. Because I, I really do need room, but... I'll bring my cherry bombs, because why not? Yeah, I'm going to get more coal, because I really do need it. I could start using the charcoal kiln, too, now that we have... Please don't use that bomb. Now that we have... Oh, just an easy 1,013 wood. Not a ton. But hey. It can be used. Go to the mines. Before I do anything here, I'm going to go right into the... Adventurer's store to see what I can sell and what I can't. Because I always remembered there's something weird about it. You're able to sell certain things, but not like everything. Oh no, you can sell all this. Okay. This is our only dagger, so I'm a little hesitant to sell it, but I really don't care. We'll find better daggers, but anything that I don't need, I'm just going to sell. Still Falchion, 2846. It doesn't show you what the stats of your own things are. 30 to 48, but it's a minus one speed. I just want to see how it compares. So the Falchion does slightly less damage, but it has more crit power and a ton more speed. So that could be worth it eventually. I mean, it probably won't be. I think by the time that we're ready to get that, we'll be... We'll have something way, way better. And I probably won't have the money to buy it anytime soon anyway. Okay, what was in here? All right. Oh, I could sell these as well. Driftwood, yeah. Cool. Well, I'm going to do what I do best. Head to floor 50 and start killing some dust sprites with the good music. Make sure I have everything laid out how I want it to be. Like that. All right, time to get to work. Wow, that's silly. I found way too many diamonds. I don't deserve all these diamonds I'm finding. Man, I, so, the thing about luck is that it's absolutely affected by, like it absolutely affects the enemy spawn rate. And I really did not find any enemies. And I think it's probably because it was a good luck day. So I had a lot more, you know, air quotes luck because I didn't have any enemies and I just was not able to get any coal. I got seven, which is pitiful really. I got, like, I, I found a diamond, but I couldn't find coal. And that sure does make it rough, doesn't it? I did get a few uh, things. I need to... I've already had the door scroll. Well, I can... I'll put it in here because I can save that as a gift for the dwarf whenever we're able to talk to it. But uh, you can't... I think I said earlier that you can give it gifts. You actually cannot... You, I mean, I think you can, but it doesn't count for anything, so no reason to put the blueberry jelly. We'll get quite a bit of money from that. Uh, sweet. Well, we got our barn rolling a little bit, so that's nice at least. I really do wish I was able to get more coal, because I, I, the sooner we can start, like, turning all of our stuff into bars, the better. Because at the very least, we could sell it. Because we just have just a stupid amount of iron ore. I wonder how much uh, some of the ore sells for. 20... 1, 2, 3, 4. 
But yeah, that's gonna... That'll help us. We'll be able to craft a lot of things with it, so... Sprinklers will never be a problem. And, you know, all that. Just curious. Starfruit Rhine, twenty-two fifty. Now, I could have left it in to get even more money out of it, but I... I don't know. It takes so long. It's like, I, I just need the money. You know... I'm going to do one more day here because I feel like I, I probably cut out a ton from these last few days. Number one source for weather news and entertainment. Now the weather forecast tomorrow. Looks like a storm is approaching. Finally. Good lord. I could make some more good humor. Really good humor, actually. Maki roll. The delicate flavor of the ocean sealed within a pillowy cloud of rice. Now this one's important. Sunday, 21st of summer. Remember that because that's actually used in a bundle. Ooh, we got our honey as well today. It's sunflower honey, which means it's going to be worth quite a bit. It's not used for any of the artisanal stuff, so don't worry about that. So I believe it's gonna be like every four days we get that. I'm gonna go ahead and throw hops in there so we get that pale ale going. What? Our... The cow came out and then it went right back in. Are y'all good? Looks really happy. Looks really happy. Probably, because y'all are on a nice big ol' farm. I bet. So yeah, the cows are going to be added to our daily to-do list. So we'll have to keep that in mind. Other than that, it'll... Why did I hear, like, things jumping in water? Did, like, fish jump out or something? Now that I know that I need to get a white egg, I'm gonna keep that around so that I don't accidentally get rid of it. Uh, Sunday, oh, it got normal bait. I could have swore it made worms. I could have swore it made worms. I guess I was just wrong. Okay, well, you know what? Those are there. I can literally just use those for crab pots. We do have the crab pot path chosen, so it makes sense just considering what I need to do. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and water my plants and I'm gonna think about what I'm gonna do today. Probably fishing if I were to guess. Epic, all right, well, I did all that. Check our, check our fruit cave. Blackberries and spice berry. Same old, same old, okay. Well, let's see, 3,300. It's not really a ton to work with until we get like our huge, now how, why haven't we gotten more Blueberries. I could have swore it was time for blueberries. Not sure. Go ahead and sell off the sunflowers. Mayo. Hmm. How much does it make cost to make a charcoal kiln, in all honesty? Wood and copper bars. Man, copper bars. The one thing I don't have. Oops. I grabbed something I shouldn't have. I think it was the frozen tier. One. One. Well, we'll be able to make enough for another copper bar for another charcoal kiln. And until then, it'll all be iron, baby. Yeah, I'll just have all these going just because there's no reason to have raw ore, really. Because it, it doesn't do anything. It's 10 wood, right? Yeah. So I can make another charcoal kiln soon. Yeah, I guess I'll get, have that going. Because it's just so easy for me to get wood at this point. It doesn't really matter. And then it was 20. Wow, funny. 20 wood. You really have to have wood to throw away, don't you? But, yeah. At this point, I think I have pretty much more wood than I'll just about ever need. So we don't really have to worry about that. Plus, like, there's certain... So, there's a thing that'll come up and fall where we'll be able, we'll have to make just an absolute ton of wood happen. So, we'll be getting plenty of wood from that. I know that for a fact. But that's also another reason you want to have, like, trees available on your farm is because if you, if you get that mission, wild mixed seeds, why? Oh boy. If you get that mission, it's like you need to get a thousand wood in a certain amount of days. Ten days, I think. And ten days is not enough time for trees to fully grow. So if you don't have a ton of trees on your farm available to get, you'll have to figure out other ways 
I don't know if buying it from the store counts. Because you can buy it from Robin if you really do want to. Yeah, this is a really good way to see your wood go uh, go down the drain really fast. I should be passively cutting down trees whenever I have the time because it comes up quite a bit that I'll have like just an hour left. I could just cut down the trees around town if I really wanted to. Uh, let's see. Hot peppers. It's Sunday, so everyone's gifts are reset, correct? Yes. So I can bring some hot pepper into town. Because why not? I don't need peppers for the... Uh... Yeah, I've already used it for the community center. I'll grab a gold one, too. Why not? Okay. Yeah, I think today's just going to be a good old fishing day. I see no reason not to. Did I pet you? I did. I don't know. Y'all go all over the place, so it's hard to keep track. I should make a fence for them. And then, like, have the grass grow into the fence. So, uh, it's a little method that will make sure that you never run out of... I should get rid of my stuff. I need to clean up my inventory a bit. Hey, we have three, uh, sturgeon. So next time that they try to repopulate, we'll get another mission for that. That'll be fun. Anyway, uh, what was I saying? Oh, I can leave my pail here. There's no reason to have my pail. Just free up as much inventory as I can. Uh, sweet. And we go. Well, I was thinking today could just be a pretty good town day. Man, I really need to figure out what you like, Harvey. I know he likes coffee, but it's valuable. I also don't care to spend all that time with my kegs at this point. Yeah, this can just be a good town day. Give everyone a few gifts. Make sure that everyone likes me. You probably like hot peppers. Yeah, sure. Just because I forgot to bring driftwood and I hate myself for it. Ruby for you. Emily's going to be getting up there pretty quick. She's already at six. We've become decent friends, haven't we? It's fine with me. You're a cool guy. Oh, sweet. Probably still sleeping. No, she's already out. Oh, it's already 12.50. I didn't realize how much time had already passed. Jeez, what did I spend all day doing, dude? I have a amethyst for em or Emily Ab Abigail. And I have a gold... I don't know. Either for Shane... I don't really know. I was gonna go and get these geodes cracked open. I guess I will give it to Lewis, because Lewis is a lot lower. Broken glasses, oh boy. You know what? No. Since no one wants to show up, it'll it'll be first come, first serve. Whoever shows up first gets the hot pepper. How's that sound? Yo, what's up? Got these new shoes, because yesterday my old pair had a brown smudge. Just threw them into the garbage. I would donate it. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, I f forgot you say that. You disgusting, disgusting boy. Also got some fire quartz for Clint. Because I know he likes that. Clint can be a pretty slow burn friendship. So I like to take care of it if I can. Wow, I needed that. I will take as much stone as I can get, though. I'd like to make some more fish ponds, and eventually I'm going to have to create the rest of my paths through my farm. Really just more for the aesthetic point of view, not because I particularly care for it or anything. I could use coal, actually. I don't believe any of these are new. Nope. Okay, we'll be able to sell it all then. No biggie. Well, let's head into the store. Oh, Haley. Oh, Haley, I probably don't have anything that you would even like. The kids. Ooh, worm. Always check the worm. Chipped amph amphora. Always check the worms. There are some things that you can only get through worms. Just to make sure it's no one's birthday, right? Yeah, there's no birthday for... Until the 24th when it's Willy's. And then we have... Uh, Stardew Valley Fair. Which is one of my faves. Jody. I know... Hold on. I know George likes hot peppers, right? Why not give him a little bit of this juice? He doesn't like hot peppers! I, uh, it's because he asks for it at one point. That's I got it mixed up. Like I said, just in 
Just because a villager asks for something does not mean that they like the item. And now I remember, George is one of the people that asks for hot peppers to help his knee, but hates it as a gift. That's so unfortunate. I don't know where Abigail is, so I guess I'm just going to start fishing. I'll start fishing for sturgeon, just because I feel like that'll be one of the most, not only expensive things to get, but also so I can fill up that fish pond whenever we need be. Because the sooner I can fill it up to full, the better. Train! Man, that sound really scared me. This is the first time we've seen the train go through. Uh, hey. Actually, I don't remember. There's some things that actually will continue to move after you pause, and I want to say the train might be one of them. So I'm not going to risk going in my, to my inventory and, like, messing that up. I only have four inventory slots open. So the train's a fun little interesting thing. Two gold sunfish. Man, I thought they were iridium, too. So... The train is an event that happens, I want to say, randomly, not on specific days, and you'll get a little no notification like we did there. And for the next little while, you'll be able to go up and catch it, and it'll be dropping items. And it's gone. And it's gone. That's unfortunate. Epic. Really epic. I can't follow it. Well, I don't suppose it would show any of the items that it would have dropped, would it? Or is it just completely gone? Nope, it's just gone. Man, that that really sucks, actually. So yeah, if you catch it in time, I guess you'd probably have to be in the top half of the valley to catch it. It can drop coal, it can drop special clothing items. Sometimes it drops entire, like, gems. So you can get some good stuff from it. So it's worth catching if you can get it. Especially for that coal. And I don't mean just like a little bit of coal. I'm talking like entire... Hold on. Another book. I'm talking entire 10, 15 stacks. So. Good lord. Well, guess it's back to fishing, huh? Oh, okay. Two ancient swords. <laughs> cool. I guess I'll get rid of that. Bream can stack. No, I thought it could. I don't really care about the stone either. Oh, they could have just stacked. Oh, that's fine. Well, ugh, man, that sucks. The library is closed. We have a bunch of new books and a bunch of stuff to donate now, but I guess I'll live without it. Also, I think I forgot. I guess sturgeon's a morning fish, isn't it? Because that whole time I didn't catch any, and I thought I would have if they were in this time zone, but no. I think I remember now they're like 6 to noon or something, which is fine, because we did get a, still a good amount of money from just the fishing that we did do. Well, any of the way, I think that'll call our pickled somethings already. And low. Pickled corn. Wow, that sounds appetizing. I'll just toss a salmon berry that'll be done in like two minutes well we can sell all the stuff we got not the amethyst you can pull whatever you put in out if it was a mistake by the way so there you go bream sunfish don't need the sandstone limestone i think that was it Ooh, before we go we can also just get these two coals going yeah, this will probably be something I'm, like, constantly tending to for the next few episodes, just so we can make sure that we have more than enough coal than we'll need. In fact, you know what? I think for the rest of this day, I'll just, like, watch that coal drop down, and I'll continue to fish up here until, like, 1230. Wow, I really did not get much out of fishing here. I caught one fish, one halibut. Unless this is a flounder or something. Super cucumber? No, Joja Cola. Well, good news. I can get a little bit of that wood that I just spent back, put the trash in there, and I'll put whatever else in here, I suppose. Trash, just because I can keep it. Got a good 10 coal, which isn't terrible, I suppose. Ugh. Halibut goes in. 
I'll grab those coals, replace them, and go to bed. That, I would say, is a pretty dang productive day. No need to put my stuff away. I'll do it in the morning. Well, thank you for joining me. I'll see you all tomorrow when we... We should be getting a bit more of our money done because we're going to get more blueberries. We're going to sell that. We're going to get our melons soon. Not soon, soon, but soon. And we ought to be pretty well after that. Pretty well ready for anything after that. See you all then. Good night. Thank you.